Hello there, YouTube. Another late evening sitting. I'm finishing the coffee and caramel. In my Missouri immersion Pride. I think it's Pride, yeah. Pride corn cob. First purpose of this video is testing my new microphone that came in today. This small thing. For those of you who must know, that is a Boya BYLM10. What it off eBay from the shop called Tom Top. They were they even sent me a nice Christmas card. Took a long time to get here, but. I hope it will streamline my recording process somehow. My iPhone, uh, iPhone 4S is, uh, it, it records video decently, but audio is atrocious. So I normally use this Zoom H2 recorder which provides excellent quality audio, you've heard it before. But unfortunately it, it also makes uh, recording video a bit of a hassle, because I record audio and video separately, then I crop them separately in two different pieces of software, then I combine them and export them. So, if this test is okay, if I manage to, the sound quality is so-so, but I will try to make it better. I'll reduce the noise, I'll probably EQ it a little bit. If it turns out it's okay, I'll stick with the microphone just for convenience sake. If anyone finds the quality inappropriate, please let me know. I will return to my to the Zoom. I enjoy working with it. Uh, I'll probably still use it for important videos, let's put it that way. So Another topic, the coffee and caramel. Now it's not working. I went through this sample pretty fast. But unfortunately for you, I'm horrible at reviewing tobacco and describing the taste. I'd say... Well, in two words. Is it a good tobacco? Yes, it's a good aromatic tobacco. Especially in the sweet department. I cannot say I taste coffee that much in it. So it's mainly the caramel, the sweetness, and the black cavendish, which is just the, the base of the tobacco. I 
as soon as I think I'm starting to feel coffee, I then give it a little, several more puffs, and I then begin thinking that it's the tobacco, or the bitterness comes from the tobacco, I don't know. So that's a good aromatic right there. The quality is good, the cut itself is pretty nice, it packs nice. Uh, it needs a little bit of drying time. You probably noticed when I opened it on camera for the first time. I had trouble keeping it lit, but it seems to be burning just fine right now. Okay, a little drier. So, I'm finished with that. Time to pick another one. Mm, one thing. When it was rolling for this tobacco, I said I'm using the D6. Some of you may not know this, that's tabletop gaming and role-playing uh, slang. D6 stands just for a regular six-sided dice. Rolling it again, using my iPad. For everyone to see, I've got the samples lined up in front of me. Okay, so maybe ah, to help with that. So that's the dice in the center. We'll give it a good shake, and we are re-rolling any twos that come up because. Two was already spent. So, five. Okay. Five is Bob's Chocolate Flake. Why go with the Hogart? Okay, let's have a look. By the way, I think many of the problems I have with tobacco are due to my atrocious cadence because, like, you probably guessed already, I'm puffing like a maniac. <laughs> Tobacco reviews. And it will probably, the clicks will probably register because it's lying right next to the mic. Oh well. We'll fix that in post. No. Mm. By the way, that's not tea this time, it's just water with honey and three pieces of lemon. <sighs> Serves every purpose I need. Mm -hmm. No, that's a plug, not a f I need a flake. Hmm, there's no flake on tobacco reviews. Just plug and Bob's chocolate ready rubbed. Hmm, I think we'll get with, we'll go with the plug then. Virginia based Burley, Latakia, flavored with cocoa, chocolate, floral, floral essences. Sorry, I'm sleepy. And vanilla. Okay, and as for the red erupt, aromatic, burl attack of a jinker. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, let's cut this guy open. See what it smells like. It's wrong probably to cut open to try to smell something while you're smoking another blend, but I don't care. I have another video to make. That's interesting. Mm. First off, the flake looks good. I'm getting just a smell of tobacco right now. A little bit of sweetness and for some reason the smell of some... I think... Smell of a drugstore. <laughs> some medication. Very interesting. Smells good. I like it. I'll try that. I'll get back to you. This one. Uh, or shall I close it? Ah, never mind. That. Okay, so this quick video is over at this point, I think. I will turn it off. Turn it on again, turn on the zoom, just as a backup, and get on with the main topic of this evening. So, if you want to stick around, stick around. If you think the audio quality is unbearable, please let me know in the comments. If you have anything to say about either coffee and caramel or Bob's chocolate flake, I am open for discussion. Other than that, see you.